Hey guys, this is JC. Um, a lot of you have lived with EpoClick for a while, or some of you are just finding out what it's about. It is a browser redirect, so a lot of times when you do a Google search, you'll click on a link, um, or you just can click on any kind of link, and it'll pop up a new window, or the one it tries to take you to is redirected to something you never clicked on. It gets pretty annoying, especially when you're doing a lot of Google searching. Um, so I'm going to show you how to take care of that. What you're going to first go into is um, your little start and go into your control panel. And in the control panel, you will find network and sharing. So you click on that, and then you'll see where you are located. And this is for Windows 7. It should be similar, somewhat similar, in um, XP or Vista and then you can click on your connections mine's my wireless one and a lot of times what it does it takes over your um, your router so like on my Apple computer it actually does the exact same thing um, so it doesn't matter if you're on a Windows or a Mac it's just gonna change it either way and let's see and a lot of times if you have multiple computers in the house it does the same thing to every single one so I clicked on my wireless router right here Windows Network and I'm going to click on properties here then you will see a version 4 and a version 6 um, double click on the 4 and then down here will, where it says use following DNS server addresses um, type in 8 and then type 8 8 8 and then on the alternate DNS server, type 8, 8, 4, and 4. This is actually Google's DNS server. Um, I use this on my Apple computer and it worked perfect. So, um, so you type all that in 8888, and then on the alternate one, 8844, click OK and OK out of the wireless network properties and close out of the wireless network connection status and we'll close this window now I'm gonna go into my Google search and we will just go to Google and we will search bread because I just made a lot of bread today now I have lots of stuff so let's click on a recipe and typically you'll have like this plus button will pop up something new and it didn't do anything we can try something else as well let's type in um, let's just type in Google and see what it gives us now let's click on Google videos and it doesn't pop anything up still we can try something else Google Earth, nothing else. We can try more links, nothing else. So just click around and you should be good to go. Thanks, guys.